okay colleagues so let's go so here you are your part okay you are on a part design no problem you can design your part that's all it's not necessary to add the material okay so now we launch the fluid scenario creation okay so this is a new app uh, the best way it's the best news it's uh, the same environment so it's good it's always the same okay the most important here is to select the assistant and you follow each step okay for the model it's a little bit long so don't worry okay so you create a new so it could be cput fluid test okay okay so it creates something okay cput fluid test okay so don't forget to to save it okay you click on model and fluid domain first plus you select your part so your part you can select remember you can go on the three select this okay second exterior boundary okay it's good it's you can create a bounding box okay you can move everything you can select etc etc okay okay you can move okay perfect now region so region you select this uh, if to, it's to say if the um, fluid is outside or inside your part so you can flip direction with this okay so for us it's outside okay that's all so now you can go back here you've got a fluid section okay okay support it's always so you can go there could be interesting to go there okay and material you select you click on the loop and you select a fluid material take what you want uh, maybe i can take air or you get kerosene oil water so i don't remember all okay so it's coming and you apply the this material to your part So we got lots of okay nitrogen oxygen water gasoline engine oil etc etc so you take air and okay okay you've got it okay now physics so i got this box here i don't want it So on physics, it would be physics behavior. So of course you know that better than me. So I know that this one is this one. Okay, and of course you jump to a transient step. So you can go there. Of course you know everything better than me. So please feel free. Initial condition, you can play with the temperature, pressure, boundaries. So I know we have to velocity okay so if, for example i click on this because i want there uh, maybe it could be uh, 40 meter per second okay and why not a pressure outside so here i've got a pressure pressure outlet okay okay and now we jump to the mesh okay so we will mesh uh, all the um, space between the part and the box so you take this one so you can play with this okay take care if it's too accurate it will take a um, lot of time to mesh okay so you click on mesh so we stop okay so there is a mesh so if you don't have the mesh you can click on the view mode and select one of this okay 
So now we can jump on the simulation. So simulate. First, you can check all your uh, scenario. And then we can simulate. So take care, the simulation can be very, very long, more than 30 minutes. Okay, so this one, model and scenario uh, check completed. Okay, and then I launch the simulation. Okay, it could be very, very, very long. It depends on your computer, depend on lots of things. Okay, and then we will check the result.